Sir, uh, Tracy's here with a bunch of kids. He wants to know if you have a minute to meet with them. Absolutely not. JD! There he is. I want you to meet the baseball team I'm coaching. A group of fine young men and one special lady. Uh, your Nays is a boy's name? Pardon me. Tracy, this is wonderful. I had no idea you were interested in baseball. I wasn't. My motorcycle hit a police horse. This is community service. These kids come from Knuckle Beach, the worst neighborhood in New York. They are poor as hell. Baseball is a wonderful sport, boys. I remember when my high school team won the Boston City Championship, everyone told us we were going to lose because our team was all white and the other team was completely... Uh, uh, anyway, we won, and I learned that anything is possible. Baseball taught me how to win. Baseball taught me how to dream. What are your dreams? When I grow up, I'm going to do vending machine maintenance. I'm going to get shot by a cop and sue the city. I'm going to be a talkative doorman with a drinking problem. That's right. You shoot for the stars. Uh, no, 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 no. These are not the dreams of winners. These aren't winners. They're 0-17. Damn, we supposed to be at the game right now. 0-18. That one's on Coach Tracy. Someday, I'll have an office like this to clean. You could have an office like this of your very own. All you need is someone to point you in the right direction, a role model. Like R. Kelly and Michael Vick. Come on, gather around, circle up. Everybody circle up. All right, circle up, circle up. Around me, around me. All right, listen, that's enough. There's a weird dude standing over there, and I don't want to get shot today, so great hustle, great practice, okay? The weird dude is gone, go home. <laughs> Good afternoon, boys. I've been thinking a lot about you, and I decided that I want to help. Starting with some new uniforms. Compliments of the Shineheart Wig Company. You want to be a bunch of winners? You've got to dress for success. That's why I sponsor a charity that gives away tuxedos to homeless people. It was a beautiful ceremony. Mazel tov. That's right. Put them on. You don't get these kids, Jack. They don't care about winning. They just want to be able to go outside for once. You know how first practice they asked me what the sun was? You wanted to see me? Hello, coach. I thought we'd have a little meeting before today's practice. Practice? Meetings? What is this, a marriage? Phil Jackson likes to give books to his players to inspire them. So which biography of Winston Churchill do you think would improve Rashid's bunting? Jack, have you ever been to Knuckle Beach? It's a totally different world. A world where orange soda is an acceptable substitute for breast milk. Tracy, I don't have to understand their world in order to help them. It's like this great country of ours. We can go into any nation, impose our values, and make things better. It's what Bush is doing all over the globe. Bush! Now, I don't want to go off on a rant here. So I suppose the next step would be to bring our superior resources to bear. Kenneth, show him the drawing of the new field. Oh, sorry. <laughs> this is my dream journal. They've all come true so far. And where are their uniforms? You can't wear blue in Knuckle Beach, which is hard because jeans go with everything. Tracy, your failure of leadership is unacceptable. Now you're gonna blame this on me? I told you this was gonna happen. Exactly. I need somebody who believes in what we're doing here. Tracy, you're fired. Kenneth, you're in charge. 